Ladies and gentlemen, the Black Ops 6 teasers continue and as we get closer to the official reveal of Black Ops 6 on June 9th, the teasers have started to ramp up as today we not only got a bit of gameplay but also our first look at zombies and also our first official reveal trailer will be coming very very soon. So early today which is actually a Sunday, we ended up getting more teasers and that is very very interesting because we got more teasers on a Sunday and as you guys know for the past two days for the weekend, we pretty much didn't get anything so like I said, it was very surprising to start the teasers again on a Sunday but anyways this teaser was a bit different from the previous ones because instead of getting a new video on the truthlies.com website actually a fellow Call of Duty content creator by the name of Noah J ended up receiving from Call of Duty a fully functional classic 90s TV and I mean he received an identical TV like the one that we see from the truthlies.com website alongside a VHS tape and once Noah J inserted the VHS tape into the TV that he got sent it played out another one of those teasers that we've been seeing on the truth Lies.com website and as that was happening channel 5 on that website ended up being updated to play that same exact video now when it comes to the actual video it was very very interesting because this video teaser that we got was actually showing some events and some things that were happening around that time period of the 90s now the reason that I'm saying this video was very interesting is because of what I'm gonna talk about here first of all we get to see a 1991 financial report and if it wasn't already obvious that pretty much confirms that this game Call of Duty Black Ops 6 will be taking place during the Gulf War and there is more in this video that suggests that as well. Following that we get to see Frank's Wood. Now I don't know about you guys but I believe that that is actually teasing the return of Frank Woods. You guys know he's an iconic character in the Black Ops series alongside Mason Hudson and all of them and I'm pretty sure that Frank's Wood is a teaser for Frank Wood to be returned in Black Ops 6. And throughout the video we get to see the US President Bill Clinton many many times, not once or twice but many times which is very very interesting. Following that we get to see this footage right here, now me, I personally believe that this is actually in-game footage, okay? I don't know why but this looks like an in-game footage, maybe it's a cutscene that plays out or it's an end of a mission, I'm not sure but to me this looks like an in-game footage which I thought that was very very interesting. But immediately following that we get to see another US President and this time it's George Bush and also we get to see George W. Bush as well throughout the video many many times but guess what it doesn't end there yet because we also get to see none other than Saddam Hussein in this trailer many many times as well and we will talk about him more later in the video and then the video continues to play more events that happened during the 90s however our next interesting bit in this video comes to the very very end of the video once the video ends it tells you to rewind the video once you click on that rewind it takes you all the way back to the beginning of the video however it shows you this a national emergency alert and then following that straight away we get to see our first look at zombies on Black Ops 6. Yes, you heard that right. We get our first look at Black Ops 6 zombies. Now, the footage of our first look at zombies is very, very brief. It's only one second, but it shows us we have two characters. One of them is sliding and the other is running. Now, they are running towards something or they run away from something. We're not sure, but we can see two characters. They're running as they are surrounded by zombies and it just ends there. Like I said, it's one second, but this is our first official look at in-game footage of zombies, of course. I'm very excited, like I said. However, all of that does not end there yet because there is more okay and it only gets more interesting from here going back to the video if you watch the video with the volume decreased all the way to zero you wait about two seconds and then you hear this morse code This Morse code translates to May 28th we shine a light on their lies and straight after that Call of Duty's own YouTube channel ended up premiering a new video called Black Ops 6 The Truth Lies live action reveal trailer which will be happening on May 28th at 7 a.m. Pacific time or 10 a.m. Eastern time. Now as we wait for the release of this live action Black Ops 6 reveal trailer we got two pieces of information from the thumbnail alone. First of all is of course we see again none other than Saddam Hussein and as I already mentioned in this video we see him multiple times throughout the channel 5 video teaser and here in the thumbnail he is back again but also if you look to the right hand side of this thumbnail we get to see coordinates if we take those coordinates and put them on google maps it shows us none other than of course Saddam Hussein's palace so there it goes it once again if it wasn't already obvious enough it is a confirmation of black ops 6 being a goal for setting game and also Saddam Hussein will play a major role in this campaign I'm looking at you guys black ops 6 is gonna be absolutely next level with the first ever four-year development and with it being Treyarch I'm telling you guys this game is definitely gonna blow us away 
away it's gonna be absolutely absolutely awesome and as always as i learn more as this live action black ops 6 trailer releases everything will be covered right here on this channel believe me when i say this you don't want to be missing anything in the upcoming weeks and even until the june 9th direct showcase event for call of duty and beyond that this is gonna be absolutely absolutely crazy so like i said make sure you do not miss out make sure you are subscribed to this channel and make sure you are staying tuned for all the latest call of duty news but with that being said make sure to click the video on the screen right now if you guys missed the previous teases for black ops 6 thank you guys for watching this video